My GP was like, well, it sounds like you have rheumatoid arthritis. So she sent me to a rheumatologist. Um, once I went to the rheumatologist, they ran some tests and they confirmed that I was um, diagnosed with rheumatoid arthritis. They started putting me on medication. First, I started taking prednisone. Then I started taking Plaquenil. And I kind of took those drugs and I was like, okay, I'll take these for right now. But I quietly became worse. And it started getting to the point where I started becoming like bedridden. I've always come from a place of, okay, you want me to take these drugs, but they're just covering up what's going on. They're not actually fixing the problem. So I wanted to know how can I actually solve what's going on? I don't believe in just this masking the problem. At this point, I was like early 30s and I was just like, I just can't this can't be right. Like, what's going on? I can't be 30 and already needing a caretaker. So I started doing my own independent research. And I started realizing that diet really had a significant effect on what was going on. And I was also um, a lot more overweight at the time. I was probably like 100 pounds overweight. I just went on a quest to try to fix myself with mind and food. And I started seeing a therapist because another thing that I also read was that it's also a lot of uh, aggression and anger that's inside of you that you know you need to let out. So I started being like, well, I need to meditate and I need to do these things. And I started doing so much better. I found a program called the Patterson program. What really helped me a lot was the food aspect, was when I ate well, that's when my symptoms would diminish. When I ate horribly, that's when they would come back full force. So at one point I was doing really well. And then um, I had a tragedy in my family. My brother was killed and once that happened, that's when I started getting worse again. And I relapsed because I think I hold a lot of stuff in. So after that happened, I gained back the weight I lost. So it just kind of spiraled out of control. So I started researching again. And that's when I came across this program called My Me, ran by this lady named Meta. And we got my food back on track and my water back on track and um, just trying to... Um, figure out what it is that my body might be allergic to, to why I'm, I am then have um, my flares. So at this point in my life, I'm not on any medication any longer. I am walking normally. I still have my difficulties because I'm not perfect with my diet all the time. If I do eat something that's wrong, I do feel it. This is one thing that I have learned after going through this journey is that this is my body and I determine what happens in my body, no, no one else. I will take what they say and I will make an educated decision, but I'm not gonna get pushed into doing something that I don't think I need to do.